So after nearly a month of effort, we've finally got to the edge of the plateau and this is our fuel depot. So we're leaving all the fuel we've brought from the coast here and tomorrow we're going back to the coast another 300 kilometers and then the winter journey starts. So in three or four weeks time we'll be back here picking up this fuel and heading for the pole. It. Looking good. We've spent about two full days uh, repairing crevasses. You know, we had to fill about ah, four of them we filled and the rest we bridged. I think there was about a dozen in total, but uh, it's pretty good. We brought the scoots down over it, uh, one full, so that's about 10 tons. And then we came up here with uh, two sledges this afternoon, uh, both full of 40 drums of fuel. So, And uh, no depression, no compaction at all, so I'm pretty happy with them. And uh, hopefully they harden up a bit though before we get back here exactly. in two months time. Okay, well as you can see, this is our fuel depot just here. Over, well, we've got 80 drums that we've left here. We'll pick this up when we come back from the coast. The official start of winter, just around to the side of me now. You can see there's the mountains just behind me. We've got our fuel scoots there. We've got our storage container which we're taking back. And this is the top of the plateau, finally. Uh, it's a bit fresh, but you can see my little, uh, little chin beard going on. But uh, we're going to go back down, it's about four kilometers back down to camp over the crevasse fields. So as long as we get back all right, everything's good as gold. Well, we've had to, this is our fuel depot, so we're leaving seven fuel scoots behind here. Now, at the end of these fuel scoots is my spare part storage for the bulldozers. So I need to carefully select what parts are going to come back with me to Crown Bay and hopefully get me back here, which is about a 600 kilometer round trip. So I can obviously take all my parts, just the key ones, and hopefully I pick right and nothing breaks. Okay, have a beautiful day in paradise.